how long will my case take in New York? Well, that question depends on many different factors. One of the main factors in to determine how long a case will take when it goes through the court system in New York is the severity of your injury as a plaintiff. If you have a serious injury, your case actually may take longer. And if you have a small injury, like a soft tissue injury, your case may be resolved in just a few short months. Now, why is that? Well, if you have a simple injury, a soft tissue, where you treated maybe for two, three months and you might have a bulging disc, but you say, I'm okay, everything is fine now, I'm feeling better, I don't need any more treatment, your lawyer can just get your medical records, send the settlement package to the insurance company, negotiate with the insurance company on a claim level. This is before even filing a summons and complaint or any kind of lawsuit. And then just this insurance company will send a check for the amount that they negotiated as long as you agree with it, you sign a release, and you get a small settlement, like $10,000, $20,000 in that, in that ballpark. Now, if you have a more serious injury, say for example, you have a herniated disc that required surgery in the form of a discectomy or a laminectomy or a fusion, now you can't really do that anymore. The insurance company may still give you an offer, but they're not going to give you millions of dollars uh, just, just from a phone call. It just doesn't work that way. So now you would have to file a lawsuit. You would have to litigate the case. You would have to give the insurance company an opportunity to question you and to take a deposition. But because you're litigating the case, because you're doing all this, you probably also have your surgeon come to court and testify if necessary. Um, you would have your deposition. You would have your medical records. You would exchange your operative reports. And now the case may take longer. It may take a year, year and a half. It might even take two years, depending on which county you're in, which court system um, you're, you're litigating in. But in the end, you will receive much more compensation, maybe a million, maybe two million, depending on how many, you, the, the level of your damages and the, and, the, and the liability that you can prove, you can get much more compensation. So there is no set time that any case will always take. It really depends on a number of factors, including how aggressively your attorney prosecutes the case, the judge you get, the court you're in, the insurance company that's involved, whether they're going to settle or not, um, the defense lawyer they hire, whether the defense lawyer just takes a laid back approach and lets the case proceed quickly, or if they start making motions and trying to delay or asking for every authorization under the sun for every medical record since you were a six month old baby, that's gonna take longer to process, obviously. So it just depends on all of these factors, but I would say one of the major factors is your injury. If it's a minor injury, those cases tend to settle quickly. And if it's a major injury, those cases tend to take a little longer, but you will get much more compensation at the end of that case.